I don't care. I gotta drive it home like this. Get your turn signals working, Ma. You ever seen a convertible truck before? You ever seen a convertible truck before? Yeah, it's yeah. There's this neighbor that's always here. Yeah. My wife doesn't want me to go on the road because we're about to go on the, to the beach and she doesn't want me to get arrested. You would definitely before. get arrested right before you went to the No, beach. man, this is not a arrest issue that they would just laugh. These wheels a while ago, and I'm gonna put them on these this 2017 wrecked F250. See what they look like because these OEM wheels are actually sold. So I'm gonna swap them out real quick and uh, see what the fitment looks like. So I haven't fixed the truck yet, but I'm already putting wheels on it. It's great. Try this again. I had the wrong nuts that I ordered, I guess, a long time ago. But uh, here's the right part number. So, I did. I just came back. I got the wrong nuts. I'm lying. Get it? Check out these wheels. I haven't posted it yet. It's the one I've been trying to download. I don't know. Because I was recording it. How much you pay for these, bro? A grand. I got them a long time ago. Still a good deal, though. Dude, they should have seen what they look like. They're all rusted. What was in the other? I uh, sprayed them with special chemicals yesterday and got most of the rust off. Really? Then I had to buy lug nuts and I had to buy center caps. So technically, like, 1250 bucks so far. Nice. We're gonna have to get get the flares off. No. You know? No, I hate flares. The truck's gonna be dirty. I don't care. So we got the new wheels on. These are getting picked up today. They look pretty good. Got the center caps. We gotta clean them up a little bit more. It says stay spooling, because these were on the diesel truck before. Um, but I think it looks pretty good. They got some ups, offset, especially now because it's uh, wrecked uh, over here. Look at that. <laughs> but uh, I think it's gonna look good when the truck is all fixed. Today I'm gonna do some work on this 2017 F250 that I picked up a couple months ago. It's been rolled over. It came from uh, Grand Rapids, Michigan, and uh, put these wheels on it not long ago. And uh, this thing is rolled over so bad that I was gonna save the cab, but I chose not to because I got another cab from Grand Rapids, Michigan. Um, this one does have a few dents over here, but this is the only damage which is not as bad as this. 
because if you look on the bottom here there's no save in this cab this cab is just too far gone so I've, I've always wanted a convertible truck and I think I'm gonna make it happen what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna remove all four doors and I'm gonna just chop the roof off and take it for a drive um, and then later on we're gonna do some with this bed as well so stay tuned should be fun for the kids so I'm gonna start off by removing these doors all four of them that way I have excess in and out and um, I did clean it up in here earlier when I first got the truck just so I can get in it and drive it so what's gonna have to happen is the headliner has got to come out um, you know all the trim around has got to come out and then I'm gonna remove all the wiring because this cab actually came with some wiring in it but some of it's cut here and there so instead of splicing it what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna completely take this new cab apart to bare metal and just swap everything over from this one onto this one and then uh, go from there I don't know if I'm gonna swap everything over from here to here and then swap the cabs I haven't got that far but for now I'm gonna remove all four doors and uh, the headliner and all that and then um, continue uh, the rear glass was good on this truck so I already had it replaced or removed and installed onto this new cab so that's gonna save some money here a couple hundred bucks for sure crazy that all you need is a 10 millimeter socket with this side ratchet from Milwaukee and uh, about five minutes and all four doors are removed uh, this these hinges got the most of it you can see that the hinge actually cracked and bent on top and bottom so but everything's so light the front doors are a little bit heavier obviously they're a little bit bigger and have more stuff in it but the rear ones are super light um, I guess aluminum, aluminum all the way. All right, I'm ready to slice this unit. I'm gonna chop it here, here, and here, all the way around. Take the roof completely off. I'll have myself a convertible truck, Jeep truck, truck. It's gonna be a truck. So it's like a Jeep, no doors, and the roof off, but it's a truck. So it's gonna be a truck. <laughs> All right, let's get the cutting. You're gonna scratch my truck. <laughs> Bend your hood. Oh. Can't believe you cut the dash, man. No, there's glass over here, dude. Okay, now we can toss it. One, two. Drop it. I think that went well. <laughs> yes. The airbag's blue. <laughs> oh, 
Yeah, so weight reduction. Plus, you don't need AC now. You can remove the compressor. Yeah. It's good stuff. Just gotta vacuum a little bit and off to Starbucks. Solid. That one's a little wobbly because it's wrecked on the bottom. <laughs> See? It's like the structure got messed up over here. Hey, but still, from a rollover, man, this thing's not bad. Solid, dude. I think I'm just gonna leave it like that. I need to find some mirrors that I can just screw on right here. Temporarily, to be 100% legal. I got a couple doors back in. Confusion. Yes. <laughs> so what, we won't be able to see anything. <laughs> we'll put a mirror like right here where you can't see except the passenger can see. Nah, no, man, you've seen the videos where they have like a CD. And oh yeah. yeah. So you can just hold the CD up. out. Just get the two Alina's mirrors. One right here, one right here. Oh. True, true. All right. Just cleaned it up inside. Got the seat belts working. Everything, all the seat belts are working. The only bags are blown at the moment are the seat airbags. And I'm thinking just to maybe uh, replace the skins to uh, leather, make a leather interior. And also, the dash is scratched up from the glass on this side and while I was cutting I used the extra long blades and I accidentally scratched it over here. So I'm thinking to maybe find a leather dash from like a Lariat or a, a Platinum or something or maybe the, get this one custom wrapped. Um, if I can get it done locally that would be awesome so I don't have to deal with chipping and once I remove the dash I'll drop it off if anybody knows anybody in the area that can actually wrap that dash into like leather or uh, maybe suede um, because uh, maybe I will do the ceiling uh, or the headliner as well because the headliner got cut I guess when that truck rolled over they were cutting the windshield out and they actually cut the headliner a bit so I may get this thing rewrapped to like suede and uh, maybe get the dash custom as well. Um, planning to keep this truck for a long time, so uh, just a, a couple things that I wanna change with it. Uh, but tomorrow I'm gonna try to take this thing on the road. Um, I wanna remove those side steps there. This one's bent and I hate those side steps, they're ugly. Um, I'm gonna check the fluids tomorrow. I did check them when I got the truck. I think the oil was good and the coolant was good, everything's good, even the AC works. So. Um, the only sad part about AC and the coolant is I'll have to drain it because I am pulling the cab and the heater core and the AC lines and everything is connected to the cab. So I will have to drain all of that, which is no big deal. I can refill it here. Um, but this thing looks funny and uh, I'm going to see what people say when I take this thing down the road. Um, I think I should wear a helmet maybe, but as far as I can see, um, it's pretty street legal um because all the lights are working the only thing i don't have is mirrors and i don't think they're required um could be wrong but it, sometimes i notice the jeeps when they remove the doors they don't have any mirrors either and that's street legal so i don't see why this wouldn't be i have all working lights all working turn signals all working seat belts um so safety wise i think i'm good but i'm thinking maybe to wear a helmet just in case um if i do get pulled I'll just say, hey, listen, at least I'm wearing a helmet. So how is this any different than like a motorcycle or a convertible? A hard time convertible is just like this. Yes, sure, it's reinforced, I'm sure, more because it's a convertible, but this is pretty good. It sits on the frame, it's a truck. I don't think anything's gonna happen. So until tomorrow. So here we go. Gotta go get some lunch. Strap in. All three, huh? I think that should be good. I got a helmet just in case. Let's roll. E-brake. Why is the brake light on? 
<laughs> we ain't got none of those. Yo, I feel like this thing would not fit through this door if it had a roof. It's super tall. Dude, look. This thing would not fit through if I had a roof. So why is this one higher? Yeah. <laughs> He's got three seat belts on. <laughs> We're just going to do a test run right here. Yo, it better not rain. <laughs> so I gotta hold this. I don't even have a no shit handle. <laughs> Yo, this is nice, man. I can't believe they don't make convertible trucks. Uh, BMW totally does. does. I would totally buy one. BMW makes trucks now. They don't make, BMW doesn't know what a truck is. Though. Yeah, it's a uh, 6 Series. Back cut off. Dude, look at all this view. My hat. There's my wife on it. Oh, I got all kinds of lights on. Close your door, bro. <laughs> Yo, this is nice. Yo, your keys in your the door. only thing is, man, turn signals don't work. Is that legal? <laughs> Yo, my turn signals don't work. That's yeah. so illegal. Why? Dude, I got heated seats. Buckle up. I thought you were joking first. Oh, dude, we're just, we're not gonna go on the road, bro. His wife says, I'm gonna go to jail. That's why I do things when nobody's around. <laughs> dude, that tire is gonna be done, dude. I don't get why you just ripped the bumper off, bro. I bent it. I bent it, Sam. Huh? Get our glasses. Uh, I forgot mine at home. That's why I'm pissed. <laughs> Yo, okay, I can't turn too much this way. How much is it today? 4.30 here? Oh, dude, it went down. Yeah, that's actually not bad. Don't be wrong. That's funny when you say 4.30 isn't bad. That's well, because it was 4.60 the other day. Yeah. Yo, we got like three thumbs, thumb, thumbs up so far. <laughs> yeah, really. make sure you open it. Yeah, make sure you open that. Are you going to turn the truck off? No, dude, because it might not start. No, can you do I thought that's illegal. It's illegal, so yeah. well, that's getting cut out of the video. Might be. Yo, I gotta do a burnout. Can you get back? How's your tire? <laughs> Yo, it's there's a chunk missing. Oh. I bent this up as far as I could, but these tires are trash. Yo, we should go through the car wash. <laughs> car wash? Yeah. Is it a touch free? Cause uh, no. we don't want to scratch the paint. Yo, I'll give you a hundred bucks if you drive this to the car wash. Mm, no. My fit's worth more than a hundred dollars. <laughs> Man, 
all these people are boring. That one lady was laughing at her. She loved she it. She loved it. Though. She loved it. She was geeking. Man, yeah. when I get back from the beach, I'm taking this on the road. I don't care. I gotta drive it home like this. Get your turn signals working, boy. I'm just gonna drive it. Use like the hand home. signals. I don't even know why I'm putting gas in there. <laughs> We're just bored. We just want to do things. Yeah, let's go get it right. Oh, you want to wait out here because I don't want to turn it off. Yeah, I'm gonna wait out here. Yeah, I'll try. We've gotten no reactions so far. No reactions. No reaction, dude. I was trying to film people driving by, but you can't really see their faces. But I'm pretty sure they're all looking. Yo, know, transmission's not in parking. Your door is ajar. Door's ajar? Yeah, your door is ajar. Get this before you get this guy coming. <laughs> yeah, how are you? <laughs> you ever seen a convertible truck? You ever seen a convertible truck before? You ever seen a convertible truck before? I just got the roof off. It was hot outside. Yeah. We're not yeah, taking it. We got it talking up, didn't it? <laughs> hey, it's got seat belt. <laughs> yeah, well, I just built that one. Put your seat belt on. <laughs> Mine's on. Alright, have a good one. Yeah. yeah she would care. She cared about my safety. Too yeah, much. she cared too much. We should have got that truck reaction. He didn't care. Oh. Yeah, I, get paid I wish my turn signals worked. Though. All these people are like, please do not bring that on the road. Like, oh god, he's gonna turn right. What's up? <laughs> god. There's this neighbor that's always here. Yeah. <laughs> they finally get some action, dude, because they're always bored. Oh, I give them action. Yo, yeah, I'm gonna do a burnout when we get back. Make <laughs> sure your phone doesn't fall out. <laughs> yeah, my hat and my Yo, this phone. actually feels good, dude. Um, that's because we're going at like, what, 30, 20, 30? Uh, imagine this on the interstate. Doing like 70 or so. There's so many squirrels and rabbits around here. Yo, my audio doesn't work, so I'm was right. No water got in there and killed my module. Man. At least I got so heated sad. seats. Dude, this, your hair is wild right is now. Is it? <laughs> There's some people looking at cars and they're about to see us drive by in this thing. Yeah. In the vertible super duty. We should get their reaction. <laughs> yo, yo, we got you a Red Bull. Okay, yo, get outside. Get, get a burn. Let me turn around. So Higher my level. wife doesn't want me to go on the road because we're about to go on the, to the beach and she doesn't want me to get arrested. You would definitely before. get arrested right before you went to the No, beach. man, this is not a arrest issue that they would just laugh like, yo, what are you doing? And I'm out. I don't think the traction is working anyway. One, I think. I couldn't see the other side, but I think it was just one. Yeah. I'll do it from this yeah, side. I think I got a lot to do. Ooh. Good, it barely wants to spin. The other one was charger. spinning. That's why I need that supercharger. Okay, I, I locked the rear dip. Yeah, I locked the dip. I turned the AC off for extra power. Here, hold on. Okay. You good? <laughs> yeah, I'm good. Oh, yeah, I think that's not good. 
I think because I have a bunch of lights on the back. <laughs> it's all good, dude. Alright, I think we're good. So this is the tire that was spinning and falling apart. It's nice and hot and sticky now. Yeah, it needs that supercharger. Yeah, it needs a lot more than that. No, it needs a supercharger and a little bit of Bondo right there. So there you have it, the very first ever F250 with the convertible top. Looks sketchy, but it's pretty fun to drive. You get all the fresh air and all the bugs. So um, stay tuned, like and subscribe. And uh, the next couple videos on this build is going to be pretty wild. So don't forget to subscribe. Later.